Birds' nests made of mud. Today we're going to find out about nests that birds build out of mud. So birds build their nests using mud. Can you believe that? Some are mounds of nests made out of mud. Some are in cliffs or in mountains. And some we find under our roofs. Let's see. Look at the birds collecting mud for their nests, scooping it up on the edge of a river or a dam. They then take it to their nests and slowly build it piece by piece. Some build these nests under our roofs. Here we see the little swallow collecting mud. It then takes it back and beaks and builds the nest with its beak. Isn't that clever? Have you seen a bird doing this at your house or someone else's? Look at the chicks peeping out of the nest, all calling for food. Some of the mud nests have really short tunnels. Look how round these nests are. This is another one with a short tunnel. Can you see the little bird peeping out of the nest? Look how different this one's shape is and look at the colours of mud. There he is. Some birds' nests have got very long tunnels. Some build their mud nests in riverbanks. Look how these birds are protecting their nests, making sure no one is coming to hurt their babies. These birds live in colonies, lots of families near each other. Some birds build their nests in, on mountain cliffs. Look at this one, high up in the mountains. Sometimes we find lots of nests together as a colony. Look at all of these nests, so close together. They nearly look like rocks when you look from far away. Look at this colony of nests. These nests have long tunnels. Lots of these nests are together. Some birds build their nests out of mud, using the mud right where they live. These are flamingos. Look at the mound of mud that they're putting together. When they've done that, they lay their egg on top of the mound. Look at all these flamingos sitting on their eggs. Their nests are made from mud, small stones, grasses and feathers. What about making your own bird feeder? Perhaps you could use two litre bottles, empty plastic ones. Look at this idea. They've used wooden spoons. You could use twigs or other sticks. Look at this one that's used twigs and other plastic containers. What about this one? Remember to make place for seeds and fruit. Have fun.